Pull back the curtain just a little bit. Every day the team meets to discuss what stories will make the show that night. And well, one thing led to another and Adam Longo ended up in a wetsuit reporting on submarine races at the Naval Surface Welfare Center. Let's just let him take the story from here. The contestants have gotten a whole lot smarter. It's not just your backyard pool, right? Welcome to the Naval Surface Warfare Center, Colorado Rock Division. Bring their underwater human-powered vehicles here to David Taylor Model Basin. Beat the hell out of ISR! They have to get to a world-class facility like this and spend the week competing against their peers. The best ocean engineering students from around the world racing human-powered submarines in Bethesda at one of the country's most secretive naval facilities. This is actually made of fiberglass. Daniel Turner from Texas A&M University is one of them. So everything that we have in here is designed and built by our students. That innovation and teamwork is exactly what the Navy's looking for. So these are the young people who are our future. Making sure we're planting seeds in the way of science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. To inspire, to educate, to engage, to attract and employ, and develop and retain. Gotta go where the story is. Today the story is in the water. We're gonna check out what the competitors are doing, getting ready to do their sub runs. We had a decent looking second run, but then some complications with our boys. 21 teams wrap up the 15th annual competition today. Adam Longo, WUSA 9.